Hey guys, it's Derek, and I am joined today by my brother Dalton and my sister Rihanna to celebrate a very special occasion. It is my 10 year anniversary on YouTube. 10 years ago on this very day, I uploaded my very first cover on YouTube, Kanye West, Good Life. And you've come a long way. <laughs> a long way since, then. since then, we've grown from this. Like we always do at this time. I go for mine, I've got to shine. Throw your hands up in the sky. To this. I like me better when I'm with you. All that wasted time. All that wasted time. Impressive clips and highlights. <laughs> Insert those now. <laughs> okay, next part. <laughs> <laughs> YouTube has allowed us to do some really cool things over the years. We launched our first tour on YouTube. We now have over three and a half million views on our channel, 23,000 subscribers. The coolest part is that we've been able to reach and make friends with people all over the world because of you and YouTube. Because of you, too. <laughs> so now we're gonna do something special to celebrate. We're counting down my personal favorite top 10 YouTube videos. And the best part about this is... We don't know what they are, so we get to find out with you right now what Derek's top 10 favorite YouTube videos from the last 10 years are. And it starts right now! At number 10, we have... In your atmosphere. Ooh. That is one of my favorites. This is a song by John Mayer that um, he does acoustic and I wanted to try to imagine it as, as a more full band, uh, instrumental, fully arranged song. And, um, so I did this in 2011 and this was my first time delving into the video song concept where I played all the instruments and I filmed everything myself and put it all together live. It really set into motion the whole concept of how um, I wanted to present music um, in a video format. So your hair looks so good in this video, Derek. Thank you. And that Thank you very much. Oh, it's like mm -hmm. the deep V. The deep V, man. You gotta uh, bring that back. It's since been you retired. Know, it's like it's gone up and up and up. You gotta like bring back the deep V. I don't know. At number nine. Mm, I'm sorry. My number nine favorite YouTube video is. Thinking Out Loud by Ed Sheeran. Oh, this is such a good Oh, I one. love doing this one. And baby, your smile's forever in my mind and my memory. And I'm thinking about how people fall in love in mysterious ways. Uh, this was the first video that Dalton and I did in our studio space. Um, we tore out the garage together and built a studio, and this was our first video that we did in there. That's, I think so it turned beautiful. out pretty good. So this, this was 2016, and I personally, I love this song, and I love the lyrics, and I thought that your piano performance was, was one of your best piano performances. And you. vocal performances, the bridge. Oh, thank you very much. This is one of my favorites because of um, because of the emotion in it. It's a song that really resonates with me. I love I love this song, and um, I really wanted to, to make it my own and also bring that emotion and that passion to it. And um, I love the way all the instruments turned out and the sound of it. And um, I'm really proud of this one. At number eight, we have. Lost at Sea oh. by Rihanna Nelson. The compass just keeps pointing back to you. I am lost. Trapped inside the line between the sea and the sky. I am lost. And I can't help but feel that you're the reason. 
reason why Derek and I filmed this together as a surprise for Rihanna's birthday in... Oh, 2012. 2012. 2012. Wow. This, is, this was one of the best birthdays ever because I woke up and I had all these notifications and I this was on YouTube on my birthday, published early in the wee morning. Mm -hmm. and. You had no idea. You had yeah. no idea. I had no idea. And the video turned out so cool because you, you guys did, um, this was another video song that you did where you actually filmed it and recorded it all together live. So what you see is what you hear, is what, is what, you, what, get. You, is what you get. <laughs> Number seven. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, we're already to number seven. At number seven, we have three deep breaths. Oh, yes. So where do we go? What were you hoping for? Everything is going to be all right. Let go of the troubles on your mind. It only takes three deep breaths. This was done all in one take. This was our first video that we did all as one take. And our dad actually filmed it. Yeah, mm -hmm. fun Because normally I film it, but if I'm in it, how can, how can we do it? <laughs> so this was the, uh, the infamous uh, Nelson Chalk Circle day oh, where yes. we, I don't know if anyone knew how we filmed this, but basically it was a very intensive uh, practice track that my dad walked around and we actually got like spray, spray chalk. Yeah. And, <laughs> laid it down in this circle so that you would have these mile markers to get to at different points yeah. in the song. So that the focus would stay consistent so we'd always be in focus um, anywhere you looked in the circle. So um, yeah, the reason I chose this one, that this, the reason why this one made the list was because this was the first video that really marked the start of Derek Nelson and family for me, which is the name of our trio project. And um, I love singing together with Rihanna and Dalton. And writing this song was um, was one of the first songs I specifically wrote for us as a trio. So it's it's meaningful for me to see the the kind of pinnacle start to the journey that we've been able to take as a trio. Number six. Somebody that I used to know. Oh! Mm -hmm. But you didn't have to cut me out. Make it like it never happens and that we were nothing. And I don't even need you now. But you treat me like a stranger and that feels so rough. No, you didn't have to stoop so bad. How your friends called you because of the change of now. Fun fact about this one, I actually filmed That's, a lot of it. Yeah. Right. It's it's one of the few videos that Derek has on YouTube that I actually am the uh, filming primary, and primary videographer director behind this. All of woman. those opening shots with all the instruments in the parking garage, mm -hmm. with all the weird little objects, objects and, stuff. and stuff. Also, fun fact about this video, I got a haircut during the making of this video. So some shots my hair is long and some shots my hair is nicely tidy and short. So. Really? It's still yeah. wearing that same cool green Same cool green shirt. Henley. Still got that green Henley? I don't. Oh, I'm sorry. There's a brown kind of velvety backdrop. That is straight, straight up blanket <laughs> hung over Rihanna's some Rihanna's favorite fleece blanket. <laughs> it's a fleece blanket. Just to give blanket. it some texture. You, know, a... you gotta get, there it is. <laughs> there, yep. there it is. Yep. <laughs> At number five, suit and tie, Woo! Justin Timberlake. Yeah, this is one of my favorite it. ones putting together. She ain't nothing but a little doozy when she does it. She is so fly, is so fly. tonight. And there's long as I got my suit and tie. I believe it all on the floor tonight. And you got fixed up to the nines. Let me show you a few things. This was so much fun. So this yeah. was released in 2013. And oh my gosh, that is just, it's one of my favorites, I think because it's so stylized and it's 
black and white. Do you have any other ones that are in black and white? Uh, Walking on the Moon pieces of it. Actually, is the whole no. thing in black and white? No, no, no. Walking on the Moon is in color. Okay, so then never mind. I think this might be the only one in black and white. And Derek plays flute in this. Ah, I love it. There, yeah, there's this dream sequence. Yeah, the, uh, wait, I forgot <laughs> all take about off your this. <laughs> Oh, we had some interesting YouTube comments about that part. Yeah. <laughs> you know, gotta, There's gotta some keep decisions the decisions and choices you looking back. You're drama. like, now why did we do this? It's like, <laughs> why not? <laughs> <laughs>2013. So this video was was one of the first times that I, that we used a technique that I learned from working on Glee, which um, instead of doing the video song concept where you're recording audio and video at the same time, you record all of the audio beforehand and then shoot multiple takes of the same performance that way you can sync it up. So this was something where we used a, uh, a technique where you speed up the audio, that way when you sync when you lip sync it, you slow it back down and it looks like you're in this slow motion thing, but it just matches up to the, the tempo of the song. So that's what it was, yeah, yeah. 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 So what it was sense? like when you were there, if if you were there for filming, Derek was singing the song almost twice as fast and I was walking backwards rapidly trying to not trip over logs and stuff. The difference between our operation and the TV show Glee was we didn't have a uh, entire a crew of like a thousand crew. people. Yeah. <laughs> it's just me and a camera, and Derek actually sang or uh, lip synced to this song. Yeah, Derek, Derek lip synced to this song and had his phone in his back pocket yeah. and could barely hear it, and somehow he's just a pro at it. Thank you. So, yeah, a lot of magic came together for this one in order to make it happen. And, um, Looking back, it's it's one of those videos that will always um, be kind of frozen in time as this special this special moment in time for the, the song and for the, the video. And you haven't been back since. I have. I have. Oh. Actually, maybe I have. We have three left. At number left. three, my number three favorite YouTube video on the list is. Every teardrop is a waterfall. Oh, this by has to be one of my is favorites. Such yeah. a classic. I turn the music up. I got my records on. I shut the world outside until the lights come on. Maybe the streets are light. Maybe the trees are gone. But I feel my heart start beating to my favorite song. And all the kids they dance. All the kids all night until Monday morning. Another life, I turn the music up. I'm on a roll this time. And remember, we rolled that big blue tub oh, the all the way the in the middle of the field. And I brought all my recording stuff. So, this was again video song concept where the audio and the video were recorded simultaneously, not what we called glee style. So, that was kind of the separation that we yeah. started having. We're like, are we doing this one for real, or are we doing it glee style where we record the audio separately from the video? So this was us, I mean, I banged that hammer on that blue plastic tub. And recorded it, brought your laptop oh all the way out to the field. Yeah. Actually, Dad was involved with this one too. He helped film some of oh, the stuff too. Oh, he helped us film he, the, he the blue tub. That, and yeah. he also filmed that really weird shot where I just sprayed Derek with the hose. Oh. Some of you might wonder why. So, Gosh. I'm not why. sure to this day. I wonder why to this day. I was like, are you sure time, you want to do like, that, man? And he's like, yeah, it'll be yeah, funny. It'll be, yeah, it'll be funny. funny. Trust me, trust me. And I was like, okay. I don't know about that. To this day, it's... At number two, we have Holocene mm. by Bon Iver. And it was a new, I was not magnificent.
has such magic for me because we, we recorded everything live and filmed everything live and um, and that to me just gives it a, a really iconic sonic signature and to see Dalton's touch on it you can really get a sense of everybody's personality in it and I love the way Rihanna's voice sounds on it and it's it's just a, a special cover I love the uh, the flute sax duet I wrote this flute sax duet for us and we rehearsed that so much because we knew that oh, we were we going to have to do it live to do it live and commit to it and um, so oh, that was really that special yeah, okay. I did too. I did too. And for those of you who don't know, I do play flute, and so this was one of the first times uh, I've ever played flute for something that I knew was going to be published yeah. online oh, in video format. This Jack oh, okay. Kovacs, our dear friend Jack, forgot his um, his electric guitar slide, and he's like, "Do you have anything I could use that would that would work to, as a slide for these guitar parts? <laughs> like, How about, How about the head of my flute?" <laughs> and he was like. Yeah. yeah! So there's a lot of confused people in the comments that are like, like Why what's is that guitar, guitar guy do? <laughs> At number one, this was a song that for me kind of encapsulates everything about my 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 YouTube career over the past 10 years. It kind of sums it all up in, in one video, working with Dalton and Rihanna, taking my own spin on things, being able to reach people all over the world. It was a song that's in the top five of my most popular uploads with hundreds of thousands of views. At number one, Wide Awake by Katy Perry. Oh, oh yes! yes. I love this one so much! <laughs> <laughs> weather and the sun and the wind and how beautiful it was up there in the, in the hills. I know I'm going to look back on these in another 10 years and be really proud and, and they hold a very special place in my heart and so I'm so excited that that is true for so many of you out there watching, that you've been with me on this ride and that these videos and these songs have meant something to you too is the biggest testament to what we do as artists. So thank you. Um, that is the top 10. I can't believe Wide Awake is number one. Okay, now we have a segment. What are we going to call this segment? Comments. Uh, the comments section. Comment, comment, mm. comments, commentary. There we go. Comments, commentary. Comments, commentary. Here's a segment that we like to call Comments, comments commentary. commentary. When you upload a video to YouTube, you subject yourself to, uh, Trolls. Not only trolls, but also people who want to give you great compliments, but also people who have some really interesting, interesting things, things to say. say. Yeah. <laughs> Here are some of those. Courtney Ray, five years ago, says, One of his nostrils are different shape than the other. <laughs> is this true? I don't know if this is true. Wait, take I, your head back. Let me see. Courtney, thank you so much for picking up on this. Mm -hmm. I now lose sleep at night. Uh, an another comment that I love. Junkie and Marnet, 2005, says... Constantly impressed by the talent and production value on these covers. Kind of makes the real video production teams blush. Oh, and great job. Simply awesome. Wonder who your bandmates are. LOL. <laughs> this was right after we introduced the clone concept where I played oh, all yeah. the instruments myself. So I thought this was especially clever to not only recognize that we do mm -hmm. this as a duo operation where Dalton films everything, mm -hmm. but that I do all the music and play all the instruments. Rebecca Caro says, I've noticed he has a really big jaw but still undeniably hot. <laughs> Thank you, Rebecca. I like how the big jaw, jaw is kind of like a, a detraction for her. She's not really yeah, about like, it. Like, I don't like my jaw, but, but undeniably, undeniably hot. hot. In all caps, no less. Lena Nerla says, oh my God, I want to live in a town full of Derricks and they all sing together and look good and just exist. I would be so happy. <laughs> Rihanna, what do you think? Would you want to live in that um, town? I no. would lose my mind. <laughs> <laughs> and this was a comment on my, my original song, Forgive Me, which we did a live performance of. This will stick with me for a long time. This is from Lorraine Sobretodo. She says, Derek, this is the kind of music that gets you right in the heart and you stop breathing for a bit because your heart's trying to hold on to that feeling that comes in each note. It's amazing. I don't have a personal experience with the song's lyrics, but it still leaves me crying. Please don't stop making your own music. It'd be a shame to deprive someone's heart of this feeling if you did. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. That is such that so one weird. of the nicest yeah. things one of the nicest I've ever read. I've ever received. That might that be so the well top written. one. One of the top three nicest comments ever written on YouTube. Yeah. Period. Yeah. YouTube that is, is, so nice. is can be brutal. Yeah. They keep yeah. it real and keeping it real with our last comment. One of my favorites, not only from because of who it's from, but just what it is. Here we go. Elmo <laughs> says four years ago, dude, this video is sick. <laughs> <laughs> no punctuation, just... Uh, so who it. nailed the profile to be able to call yourself oh, yeah, Elmo. Elmo? That's awesome. That's so, so thank Derek, you. We are so proud of you, man. Yeah, thank so you. Proud of you. To another 10 years. Yes, yeah. and I want to say thank you for all the wonderful comments, all the interesting comments. Keep them all coming. Keep, Keep them all coming, coming because feedback. it keeps it real and yeah. it, it keeps us doing what we do and we'd love to hear from you. Last thing, to celebrate my 10 year anniversary on YouTube, I will be releasing an ongoing massive collection of cover songs split into uh, different installments of albums to be released on Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, my website, and Covers Volume 1 comes out this month. So please check the website and make sure you're on the mailing list at DerekNelson.com. And we'll see you on the next YouTube video. Thank Yay! you so much. <laughs>